Okay, it's my hip. I think it's my hip. God, I'm so nervous. Ah! <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. My name is Ifiuba. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and for sticking with me. And if you're new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video to watch it. And I hope by the end of this video, you click the subscribe button. So I'm just going to be sharing a few things that I've been loving lately and just things that I generally don't regret buying. Yeah, they're going to be both recent like buys and things that I just keep repurchasing. So things I've been using for a really long time now. I took notes of everything I've been loving lately. And I kind of put them into categories to make things simpler and easier for me, you know. So it's not just like, Things that are all, all over the place. Yeah, there are like four categories here: yeah, skincare slash beauty products, is home slash room decor. There's the fashion category, and then the last one is just named random because it's literally only one item there. I, I really didn't know where it will fall under or what to categorize it as. So let's just you know, let's just leave it there. But yeah, without wasting too much time, like I already have, let's get right into the video. So the first category is skincare slash beauty products and the first item on that is this is but it's just very i've put this in one of my vlogs and if you watch me or you stick with me i love you but yeah if you if you watch all my videos you know that i've mentioned this when i got this like i showed you guys and it's just one of those items that are so random like it's one of those items that you're looking at like do you really need this do you really need this but you do you need it especially if like you're a skincare girly and you're really into skincare and stuff like that or just generally like it doesn't have to be oh that you're into skincare if you're someone who just washes your face every morning at night and like you struggle with like you know the water dripping down from your hands to your floor and everywhere's just messy this helps a lot with that it's like it's the, it's just it's just innovation the next item on this list is my inky list oats balm on the screen I got this from Sephora last summer and I remember just wanting to like try it out like for this I was using the chamomile um, Clinton balm from the body shop and uh, that one's really good as well um, I really like it but I just wanted to try this out I like, never heard of it anyway I just saw it and I picked it up like wanting to try it and see it was actually I and my sisters I love it I love using it to take on my makeup it takes everything off like it everything just glides off no stress so if you think about getting this product this is your sign to get this thing the next thing I'm going to be talking about is the glow recipe watermelon glow ultra fine mist you guys already know if you follow me on instagram i just just one of those products i was just like ah uh, let me try as well i wanted to try you know me try try don't get it too stick because i don't even try skincare products like that i don't i don't like to try myself but i have just said oh let me try let's see let's see and i love this thing you guys like this thing makes my makeup look like skin like I can't think of anything that has made my makeup look so good. This thing brings my makeup together. It makes my makeup look so dewy, so sheer, so effortless. Like, I can't see my makeup right now. This thing, if you know days when you don't wear makeup, you've done your skincare, and this is the last thing you put on, your skin is going to look so glowy. Like you've done something extra, but you haven't. This thing is so good, and this is my second bottle. Same goes for the cleansing balm. This is my second too. The next thing on my list is simple patches. I actually recently stole this one from my mom. I've been hearing a lot about pimple patches, but like I, I didn't really think, oh, let me try them. This is the 12 Whitehead Absorbing Hydrocolloid Dots. When I tried this, actually that's cap. I tried the Starface pimple patch, the one that you get from Boots. I don't have any picture of that one, and I really liked it. And then I stole this one from my mom, and I tried it, and it was equally as good if you guys follow melissa wardrobe she has talked about like a particular brand time and time again i forget to take a screenshot of it but like 
I really want to try more pimple patches like from different brands especially the brand that she talked about because she sounds like it's really doing what it's supposed to do but once you've washed your face you can put them on on like a freshly washed face and then put your skincare on top of it which I think is really really nice because of they are almost non-existent when you put them on you can wear them out as well which I think is really interesting the next thing on my list I talk about this on my next vlog this is an eyebrow pencil that I got from Muse Market. I remember using this eyebrow pencil. I had told my sister, I asked her for an eyebrow pencil, and then like she gave me this one. I used this for my eyebrows, but then decided to start using it to line my lips. I, I ran out of it and I was asking her where I can get it. She said, Oh, she got it at Muse Market for like 100 naira or 200 naira. I didn't have it for a while and I was looking for something similar, which made me get the mac costa ricci i hated this thing like i will still use it don't get me wrong but i did not like it because it just moves when i put it on and then i put my lip gloss over it it moves and i hate it like like what was the point like i'm paying so much for this and this lip liner doesn't even stay like it just moves it just moves like why are you moving why are you moving like this thing pissed me off so much i'm not even going to lie but this one i put this thing on and it does not move i got it from Muse market for 200 naira or 100 naira and it's it's just doing the lord's work you guys you <laughs> didn't call the name i got daily's eyeline oh it's actually a lip pencil as well and it doesn't move so why is it not moving Davis Island Lip Planner Pencil from Muse Market is my guy and I will continue to use this guy. Next thing on my list is this Triangle Powder Puff. I was seeing a lot of makeup girlies using this on TikTok, on Instagram. I love it. I've really been loving this lately. I love how this is angled. So obviously you're getting these sides really well when you're putting... I use this for my... to set my face. So I'm really getting these sides really well because of how angled it is. This is really good. I love this. The next thing on my list is my Dior Lip Go Oil. You guys know how much I love this thing. I don't think I I need to say much. Like I don't know what it is about this Lip Go Oil from Dior. I don't know if it's crack. It's just always sold out. Like it's just always sold out. And I use the shade. So I use cherry oil. And the next thing on my list is this Mac blush in the shade Love Thing. I've had this for a while, and that's. The only blush i use i really want to try some cream blushes and some liquid blushes that this is the one i've been using this is the only one i use this is the only one i use and i just love it next thing on my list is the milk hydro grip primer if you've been watching me you know how much i love this you know how much i love this primer when i ran out of this and couldn't find it anywhere because i was in night it just changed i started using this i started using this all nighter face primer not because of i wanted to but if you watch my youtube videos or anything that has to do with like my makeup videos or whatever you know that i always say like i love my makeup dewy i love it when it looks like skin i, I hate a, a matte look i hate it and this thing was making my skin so matte like it works and it's good for those people who love matte makeup looks but for me i love a dewy makeup look and this one it's just always going to do it for me. I feel like you should subscribe to her because she's really good. Mm -hmm. Guys, moving on to the next category, which is home slash room decor. Um, I'll say room decor to be honest because obviously I'm, this is my, I'm just, just, just my room. First thing on this list is my Apple HomePod. I don't regret buying it. It's not necessary. It's not a necessary buy, obviously not a necessary buy, but I love it. I love it. I don't regret buying it. I love this home pod so much. And it just fits well in my room. The next thing on my home slash room decor list is my makeup organizer and my skincare organizer. So I'm going to insert a picture or a video of you know my makeup organizer, skincare organizer. I love them so much because they just make my life I feel organized. I feel like an organized babe. Things are exactly where they're meant to be. It just makes sense i just love when things are organized that's why i love them so if you think you don't need like an organizer in your life trust me you do they make your space look so much cleaner i got mine in america i got them off home goods my makeup organizers from home goods and i got my skincare organizer which is in my bathroom 
from Burlington in America but you can obviously get all these things off Amazon because Amazon has everything like there's nothing you're ever looking for that you won't find on Amazon the next thing on my list is my adhesive phone stand which is also in my bathroom I'm going to insert a photo or a video so you guys can see again I put this on my vlog and it's random but I love it because I've been needing it I'm someone who likes to FaceTime people when I'm doing stuff in my bathroom when I'm doing my skincare when I'm washing my makeup brushes like I just I'll randomly get like a FaceTime call laugh or I'll FaceTime somebody and instead of putting them face head up instead of keeping my phone somewhere and they're just looking at the ceiling because it's FaceTime they must be seeing my face I've just always wanted something where I could like you know stand my put my phone up 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 on I'm doing what I'm doing they're seeing me I'm seeing them we're talking that kind of thing like, it's random and some would say it's not really necessary but ne it was necessary for me next thing on this list is my woven baskets I'm obviously going to insert a video for you guys to see my woven baskets I have a couple of woven baskets in uh, my room and then in my bathroom i just love it i feel like because of like the furnitures in my room as well uh brown wood vibes i feel like they just make sense and they blend in and kind of elevates the look of my space the next thing on my list is my sewing books again you guys have seen these are sewing books um i love them so much i showed you guys the ones that i have and my previous vlogs and i really want to keep collecting them just because like they add to the look of any room they elevate the look of your room of your space they just look very rich and the next thing candles candles are the next thing on this list this type of candles some of them are scented most of them are not but like candles like this i'm just showing you guys these ones because these are the ones that are closer to me just being obsessed with like buying them the body candle these guys like i have um some more there again my space just looks so pretty with them that's why like, i'll keep collecting more of the type of candles these ones that i show you guys are from primark again i have a vlog where like i unbox these and i told you guys where i got them from so if you want to find out where i got those videos so we're moving on to the next category which is fashion the first thing on this list is my Craig Gaga purse this small purse I don't know you guys I love this purse so, so tiny that every single wear I wear it to somebody is always thick ha 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 what are you going to put inside here oh ha, ha, ha. what does this your bag even fit oh, and I'm thinking what your business like <laughs> But this is my favorite purse ever because the thing is that sometimes when i'm just looking to like go out and run a quick errand there's certain bags i don't even want to carry even the small bags that we feel, i feel like oh yeah these are small bags like you know i can definitely use i don't want to use them i don't want to use them so ever since i got this bag this has low-key been like my mm, you know not really going anywhere there's nothing that deep or going out to run a quick errand so the things that i really need to fit inside this bag is my cards some cash and my airpods that's all everybody that asks me ha 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 what can i even it can fit it, the things that i need for the i don't i must not explain myself to you and it looks so good with everything and anything you wear to it looks so so good another item under the fashion category that i've really been loving lately and i don't regret buying are these heart shaped hoop earrings from asos i love them so much they're really good quality and i've worn them a lot ever since i got them so the next thing on the fashion list is my crotch my bestie actually gifted me these crocs for one of my birthdays and they're just the most comfortable shoes ever i wear these things everywhere so the next thing on this fashion list is my scrunchie yeah, like you shouldn't use anything that literally pulls your hair out when you you want to take it out or when you're putting it on that's why i really love this scrunchie and i'm going to buy more colors you know that will go with more outfits but for now i only have this black one that i really really love so the last thing on this list are hair curl clips i would always get not less braids with french curls just to use these things just to like clip them and then have my curls like you know i've really been loving them i love the way like they just elevate any look that i have be it braid weave like they just make you look so put together so the last thing 
ever on my list which falls into the random category is this is the we are not really strangers card game so i remember wanting this so much my bestie gifted me this as well i i was i was talking to her about it one day the next day this day got it for me shout out to my best friend guy because this day really be gifting me <sighs> but yeah it's good to have good friends <laughs> i think it's with like my um close friends and it's just a really great card and it has a good way of like bonding and connecting people you obviously play with like your close friends and friends that you're trying to know on a deeper level and bond with that's why i really really love this card okay so that was it for this video i really hope you guys enjoyed watching don't forget to like comment share subscribe all that good stuff and see you in my next video <laughs>